Thank you and welcome for mathematics lesson. Today we are going to solve a logarithmic equation here, whereby we are trying to find the value of y in the equation below. Then we have log 16 to base y plus 3, the logarithm of 4 to base y equals to 10. Therefore, as you can see, these are not the normal equations we are used to, because they are known these are the base. And to solve this equation, solution, uh, we can first of all apply the normal laws of logarithms. Uh, for example, in this case, we can start by saying the logarithm 2 base y of 16 plus the logarithm 2 base y of 4 power 3. 4 power 3, which will be 64. Because we know that uh, when we have n, the logarithm of y of a, this can be solved by taking the logarithm of a raised to n. So we apply it at this stage. Logarithm to base y of 4 raised to 3, which should give us 10. Then the next step, we can apply the law of logarithm, which says the logarithm of a plus the logarithm of b can be solved by just having the logarithm and a multiplied by b because of this plus we can go to that other stage which will be the logarithm 2 base y of 16 multiplied by 64 equals to 10 and this will give us the logarithm 2 base y of 10 24 which is equal to 10 so after that we can now change this expression from logarithm form to index notation. Remember we say that when we have the logarithm of a to base b equals to c, this implies that when we take b power c, we should get a. This is an index notation. This one is logarithm form. So we can change an expression or an equation from logarithm form to index notation. And changing the one we have here, then we can say y raised to 10 should give us 10 24 we can express 10 24 to its simplest base and this will be y equals y raised to 10 equals to 2 raised to power 10 if y raised to power 10 equals to 2 raised to power 10 since these indices are the same then it means the bases are also the same since they are being raised to the same index and are being equated. So this means that y equals to 2. Because when we raise y to power 10, we are getting what we get after raising 2 to power 10. So the answer is 2. Subscribe to this channel and share the link. Thank you.